All the way from UMass, number 27, Ray Pagosi. The red-headed beauty, but no longer red-bearded beauty, number 29, Seth Ensor. Assistant coach for your River Dragons, Grant Sherwood! <laughs> Head coach, behind the bench, holding the lineup card, Jerome Boom Boom Bishon! General Manager and most obnoxious color commentator in the league, Scott Brown. <laughs> Team owner, executive, Ignite Sports, Jeff Second favorite announcer, Zach Bozart. How are we doing, everybody? These guys have done it. They are champions. I gotta tell you, we're gonna have a lot of them come up. We're gonna have a few of them talk. There's so many people to thank. First and foremost, you guys, the fans, you guys dealt with so much to be able to get into the Civic Center to come watch us play. But believe me when I tell you, every single one of these guys heard you guys cheering your heart out, night in and night out. It all mattered as we brought home that beautiful cup. Pass the mic over real quick here to Jeff Crew. Jeff, say a few words for us. Thanks everyone for coming out. I want to thank uh, Brett, Brandy, the folks from Fort Benning, Harley Davidson. Always do a great job. They've been behind us all year. I want to make sure I mention our hard work and staff. It's been the longest eight weeks ever. Um, the guys who uh, played through a lot of adversity pretty, pretty much up until the last week of the season. Who else? And uh, I'll give it back to Zach Thank and the fans, of course. It was the loudest 1,500 people I ever heard. Give it up, Chuck Group, everybody. Throughout this season, I mean, Jeff mentioned it. It probably felt like the longest eight weeks, and let's be honest, it felt like the longest time to even get this season to happen. I'm sure there were plenty of people that maybe thought it wasn't gonna happen, but it did, and the team battled through so much adversity, and again, you guys by our sides meant so much, and we wanna thank each and every one of you. And before we get to any of the players, we're gonna first turn it over to the head coach. You know him, you love him, Jerome. Boom, boom, b -star. I may have to turn around because I'm going to cry. Um, no, you know what? Uh, I can't be more proud of these guys. Um, we're missing a couple guys that had to go home uh, a little early. Uh, Connor Fries is up in uh, Knoxville. Uh, Preston Schumann, I think, went home. Uh, Jacob. Yeah! Uh, and I think... Is Matty O'Day here? No. So we're missing four guys. I, I said him. Um, but anyways, you know what? Uh, it was a whirlwind. I just can't be more proud of these guys. Uh, more grateful for you guys for sticking through 
and supporting us through this crazy time. Um, thanks, Harley Davidson, Zombie Pig, the Chattahoochee guys over here throwing axes. Um, all of our sponsors, uh, the fans, the wives, girlfriends, significant others, uh, our staff, uh, Zoya, where's Bri? Is he here? He's there. Training staff, um, you know what? Uh, I'm just uh, so excited to do this again in front of all of you and give Columbus something to grab onto and hold on to, and uh, let's do it all again next year with uh, 4,500 people in Columbus. Thank you. Jerome Bichard, everybody. Listen, this season was so incredibly intense, so incredibly competitive. These guys battled night in and night out, and I was doing a little stuff to get ready for it. And if anybody wants or cares to know, doing.